challenges the first couple of years were definitely hard. Um, once Alvine had come in and he recruited, I think it was, if I remember correctly, 19, 19 girls because everyone had graduated and it was a couple of us left over. So he had to bring in a whole new team and I think that was my junior year. So I was only able to play with these girls for two years, some of them for only one. Yeah, so it was a, I mean, a huge difference from my freshman and sophomore year to the junior and especially senior year. Um, junior year, we were still getting used to each other, but to have 12 wins was like so impressive. It was great. And then senior year, it was just, we all clicked and he recruited a great class and it was, we all clicked and we did what we had to do and made it to the NCAA and it was amazing. I couldn't have asked for a better senior year. The girls made it so special. Alvine made it so special. Um, it was just the best year of my life. I'm going to tear up talking about it. But um, so a specific game I'd have to say was against IUP and it was a home game. And it was actually my senior day. So um, it was just, it's a rival, IUP's a rival. You always want to beat them. They had attitudes and we were, we were like, we're not, we're going to beat them. So senior day, I ended up scoring four goals. Um, it was four zero and that's the game I actually broke the school record. So um, I was one above think the school record and that was the game I broke it and it was 4-0 I scored the four goals and honestly like I think it was so surreal like it happened and it couldn't have happened if it wasn't for the team I would have never scored as many goals as I did if it wasn't if I didn't have everyone behind me helping me do it thank you to my mom and dad for everything they've done for me um, thank you for giving me the support and love I needed to chase after my dreams and for always believing in me they never missed more than two games my entire soccer career. Uh, they put so much into making sure I had what I needed to be a good soccer player and a person. Because of them, I am who I am today, and I can never say thank you enough to them. I owe them everything and more. Um, next, thank you to the girls I have played with throughout my years at Cal. Thank you for all the amazing memories. You have left lasting impressions on me, and I have the best of friendships from it. I would have never been able to accomplish what I did if it wasn't for a great group of girls that helped me. You mean all the world to me, and I'm so thankful for you all. Thank you to Lassie, Emma Dean, and Alvine for believing in me and helping me become the player I ended up being. And lastly, thank you to my husband, Zach. He stood by my side for almost my entire college career, even traveled to the NCAA tournament, and after and after for all the trials I went to. I'm so lucky to have married him and to have the two best kids together. And thank you to Cal U for accepting me into the Hall of Fame. And um, the school's amazing, everything. So thank you.